Hello Sagittarius and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of August 17th through the 23rd. And yes, my coffee cup readings are back. I am back from vacation. I know a lot of you missed it. So they are resuming. Okay, so this is a very um, general reading. Let's see what shows up for Sagittarius. Sagittarius, what do we see here? Sagittarius, you have to have patience and slow down and kind of be, there's a sense of caution. Oh, yeah, you're going to have to be cautious this week, and we'll get into that. Um, to gain anything, money, work, um, your goals, your projects, it's slow and steady. You have to be aware that things will build, but it takes time. Like, just say you started a project, you started a blog, you started something, and you want instant results, and you maybe you worked on it for two, three weeks, or a month maybe three months, maybe a year. And you're like, no, 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 this is not working out. Things take time. Okay, you will be successful, but you, things take time. That is the message I'm seeing here. So proceeding with caution is very important. I feel also if you're waiting for something, this could be um, something solid. You know, I feel in the next, this could be money coming in or an offer, maybe it's work, whatever it is. Give it about maybe two weeks before you see some kind of results. That's one thing I'm seeing too for some of you, okay? Okay. Yeah, I do see it's like you're indecisive. This is like you've been working. You've been gaining and working and putting some energy into either a project or work and you're kind of like coming to the point of I'm tired um, I'm worn out. Um, should I? Should I not? So you've got decisions to make. But again, it's, you know, think about before you do move, you know, move away from something that's been a good thing. Um, it's like your challenge here is like you've got ideas, you want a new path, but which is fine. You can attract things and start new things. But again, follow through is something that you need to do because it's like second chances are rare you know, once we start something, if you see a lack of follow through, then it's like consistency is important. Let's put it that way. OK, so that's one thing I do see. Now, I do see here that someone may be. You know, just kind of coming up with their own. They could be criticizing you, um, very opinionated, meddling into your business in a relationship or something. So I'm seeing that too. I see some of you have been either betrayed or hurt by someone from the past. Now, if you reconnect it with someone from the past, that's for some of you out there. You know, you, you deep down, you knew it wasn't right for you and you end up getting hurt. So I'm seeing that. It's like there's a sense of you've been hurt or disappointed. <coughs> Excuse me, heartbreak is showing up. Okay, it's in your base here. Um, I do see that there has been advice given to you and you knew your intuition you needed to trust your intuition, but at the same time, you kind of went against it. You got to keep trusting your intuition. This is a um, supportive person, too. This could be a mother, a friend, or someone who is very supportive, who actually has known or tried to help you out, okay? So that is showing up. For some of you, this could be a water sign energy, too, or someone who exhibits those energies. Um I do see new people, new experiences, new passions are coming through too. So if you keep moving forward and with patience, things will um, happen. There's going to be some adjustments with your home and foundation too, okay? It's like there is um, changes coming in. Maybe someone comes and um, unexpectedly visits or some, makes some kind of a change, okay? Um, I do see a lot of delays. A lot of things are being held back, but there is a lot of confusion. And I have to say... Um, it's like deception, somewhat, you know, dishonesty. Things are not exactly clear. Okay, so you have to trust your intuition and try to gain more clarity in some certain situations. Okay, there can be some kind of an offer coming through too. All right, um, I do see there will be some kind of you know victory because you're holding up that. It's like light, lighting the beacon, some kind of a victory. It's like you're driven. You want to succeed. You want to move forward. But again, you have to be careful. Um, slow it down somehow and follow through is very important. You kind of, the energy is all over the place. It's like, you know, it's like you're here, there and everywhere or people around you. Maybe a lot of things are just coming at you at the same time. It's kind of scattered. Okay. There will be some um, news coming in, 
Okay, it looks like good news too. Um, you have to stay positive. And there is a no here, not to, um, I don't know, because there's a no answer. And it, this is because something is not exactly revealed. Now, what I'm seeing here basically is there is a sense of, I wouldn't play with your luck, like if you're gambling or in games of chance. If you're trying to like push your luck with, like I said, you know someone's bad for you and you're pushing your luck there and you're giving it a second chance. It's like you're going to come out unlucky or hurt. So it's like unlucky in the game of, cha of chance. So taking chances, make sure, you know, you know the past, you know, you know, try to take calculated risks, all right? Because there's a sense of your luck is not there, okay? Now, I see travel, or for some of you, this is like a pleasant drive. Maybe, um, you know, you kind of go for a drive and you clear the air, or this is just um, a sense of a pleasant journey, okay? It could be a short journey or something like that is showing up. Um, I do see you have to be warned and be careful of dishonest and scrupulous people around you. Again, there's a lot of that kind of energy showing up. And if you've been hanging out with these people, it's really time to get rid of them. It's like they've hurt you once, they've hurt you twice, they hurt you four times. I mean, how many more times, okay? So you may you have to kind of stop giving chances or, um, yeah, because I see dishonest, scrupulous people, you have to, it's a danger from them. They could be leading you the wrong way or, you know, so there is this energy needing, needing to finally separate from dishonest and scrupulous people, okay? All right, um, Sagittarius, that was your reading for the week of August 23rd. Follow me on Instagram, August 20, no, August 17th through the 23rd. Maybe the 23rd will be exactly significant. Follow me on Instagram. I follow, I um, post daily readings and also daily birthdays. Have a wonderful week and catch you back next week for your next coffee cup reading. Until then, all the best and bye for now.